Hello everybody, Crystal here. So here's the Holman Grove update, September 8th. We got raspberry bushes. Uh, a neighbor who lives in this building is watering them, which is very nice. There's still a little English ivy left, but most of it we ripped out at another work party about a month ago. So as you can see, gone gone mostly gone English ivy carcasses we killed all the thimble berries guys I'm sorry I didn't plant them soon enough um, Cheryl found those raspberries back there the neighbor was redoing their yard or thimble berries dead didn't plant them soon enough. Suspected the roots were all moldy. So I killed th two th four thimble berries. I killed two grape vines and I killed two Rosa Ragosa. Full confession. Would I be shrived? Okay. Look at our goji. Look how big it's gotten. Hi, goji. That one's doing good. I planted that one. Blueberries, fine. I guess I underwatered that one. That's why it's always been kind of red. This goji. Shrimpy. So here's the hoogle. Blueberries are doing okay. I've slightly underwatered them. But, you know, they're not, they're all right. They bounced back. Um, we had so much fetch here. We had so much other things, but now we've got some flowers coming up. Um, we just sort of mulched with burlap. Greek mullen here is doing well. So we got the eight blueberries on the hoogle, and some flowers and clover. Kiwis are growing, finally, going up. I didn't prune off all the side branches fast enough. For the females, this is a male. It just wanted to go straight up. But the females, um, they wanted to branch out. And I was like, oh, I should not want to take all their branches. But then eventually I did. And then they started going up. So just prune. Prune like they tell you to, I guess. All right. And here's the rest of the strip. So we got rid of the... There was some English ivy coming up in this area. But everything is fine. Sword ferns and manzanitas up the Rosa Ragosa, which I killed. So there's your Holman Grove update. Um, so this is on city-owned right-of-way land, all of it. Um, and we got permits to do this. And before it was invasive species, and now it's like stuff that in a few years will be edible. Kiwi's probably like nine years, but the blueberries, they'll pr start producing some food next year. Raspberries are already fruiting. Um, so yeah, let's, let's do this with city-owned right-of-way land more because why should cities suck and be full of invasive species when they could be full of food and stuff? So blah, blah, blah. All right, bye.